But what I want you to focus on is on the size of the national identity groups and the way that they've changed in the five years between 2016 and 2021. And what we see is that the proportions of the electorate identifying as either Welsh British or English British have fallen. Um, the Welsh British fallen quite significantly, actually. Um, and it's meant that now the Welsh only group which has grown, as has the British only, not English group. The Welsh only group is now the largest identity group in Wales, which wasn't the case five years ago. Now, you know, this raises, I think, a really intriguing possibility. Given that Brexit has been revealed ever more clearly as a national project, that is a project that seeks to undergird and project a particular understanding of a national past, present and potential future, to what extent are we seeing those people who reject that national project also rejecting the national identities that associate most closely with that project?